hello dear students so this is just a doubt clearing uh, lecture okay so those who many most most of the students i have seen that they are making many many mistakes okay so i don't know how many i have pointed out but uh, as far as possible i am trying to clear your doubts so first of all the first thing what i want to clear it is that whenever yes whenever you you see a compound given right whenever you see a structure given like the red colors one i have written the question and the blue color ones are the solution so see in the question the red colored what i have written say in the question you can see what is written this one this one okay this so it is written ch2 double bond c whole ch3 ch double bond ch2 now students you remember that the ones the groups which are written in group uh, bracket okay like this ch3 is written in bracket mostly the uh, carbon hydrogen containing groups i am talking about so that groups which are normally written in brackets okay that that means what that they are not normal tum khud dekho students tum log ye notice karoge ki ye ch2 ko bracket mein kyun nahi likha gaya bhai ye ch ko bracket mein kyun likha nahi hai only ye ch3 ko bracket mein likhne ka kya matlab banta hai that means that this ch3 which is written in the bracket is somewhat different from the other carbons right so you should understand that this ch3 group which is written in the bracket it is not in the main chain okay so when you write like this when you are writing the compound you are directly writing like this some of the student the ch2 double bond c then you are writing single bond ch3 then you are writing ch and then you are writing double two, uh, double bond ch2 like this you are Right. Apply your common sense. That already I have said you that carbon is tetravalent, right? So you see this carbon. If you see already three hydrogens are present with this carbon, and these two bonds are also the bonds of the carbon, right? ये carbon का आ carbon हमेशा four bonds form करता है. ये मैंने first lecture में ही बता दिया था. So now you see कि एक bond तो यहाँ पे carbon बना रहा है. ये वाला carbon, right? एक बॉन्ड ये इधर बना रहा है और तीन ये बॉन्ड हाइड्रोजन का साथ बना रहा है तो टोटल कितना हो गया पांच हो गया लेकिन कार्बन के अराउंड में तो फोर बॉन्ड्स ही होना चाहिए दैट मीन्स ये सी एच थ्री ग्रुप का जगह ये चेन में नहीं है ये स्ट्रेट चेन बोला जाता है इसको कार्बन का चेन है ये ठीक है तो ये जो सी एच थ्री है इसका जगह ये चेन में नहीं है राइट right? अगर होता तो इसका वैलेंसी फुलफिल हो जाता है राइट दैट मीन्स दिस सी एच थ्री ग्रुप इज नॉट प्रेजेंट इन दिस कार्बन चेन राइट so the simple meaning is this so how do we write this ch3 group okay so this ch3 group when it is written in the bracket means what either that means it is connected to this carbon okay and it is present either above this carbon or below this carbon it is not present in this chain condensed formula may we write like this jo question mein likha hua hai that is the condensed formula in the condensed form this is the condensed form condensed formula we write like these shortcuts but when you write the main uh, structural representation you have to understand that this ch3 is not in this chain it is either above this carbon or below this carbon so here i have written the uh, uh, the representation i have shown so you see how i have written so first to follow your first uh, point should be you have to mark it you mark like this number 1 carbon number 2 carbon number 3 carbon number 4 you see why i am not marking this carbon why i am not marking this carbon because this carbon is not present in the chain it is written in bracket means it is a substituent of this carbon number 2 substituent kya hota hai ye tum log abhi padhoge theek hai to jo bhi groups jo bhi carbon hydrogen bracket mein hoga samajh lo wo स्ट्रेट चेन में नहीं लिखना है आइधर ऊपर होगा या नीचे मतलब ब्रांच में होगा ये एक ट्री का सपोज ब्रांच है तो दीज आर दी सब ब्रांचेस सो दीज थिंग्स विच आर रिटर्न इन दी ब्रैकेट दे आर नॉट प्रेजेंट इन दिस ब्रांच इट इज प्रेजेंट आइधर एबव और बिलो सो दिस शुड बी क्लियर टू यू सो वेन आई एल मार्क आई एल नॉट मार्क दिस कार्बन एज थ्री ओके आई एल स्कीप इट बिकॉज इट इज नॉट प्रेजेंट इन दिस चेन जो चेन में है उसी का मार्किंग करना सो वन टू थ्री फोर राइट so now you see first of all you give me 
टू थ्री एंड फोर राइट सो नाउ वी विल डू एस पर आर गिवन सो वट इज गिवेन कार्बन नंबर वन सो यू राइट लाइक दिस कार्बन नंबर वन देन देर इज अ डबल यू फॉर गेट द हाइड्रोजन यू फॉर गेट एवरीथिंग नाउ यू जस्ट राइट कार्बन सो कार्बन नंबर वन सो दिस इज वन देन वॉट इज देयर डबल वन यू राइट डबल वन देन कार्बन नंबर टू देन वॉट इज देयर सी कोई बॉन्ड शो नहीं किया है अगर ऐसा लिखा हुआ है ना कोई भी कंपाउंड लाइक सी एच थ्री सी एच टू समझ जाना कि ये कार्बन और ये कार्बन का बीच में सिंगल बॉन्ड है जब भी भी कंपाउंड में बॉन्ड शो नहीं किया है दैट मीन्स देर इज अ सिंगल बॉन्ड ऑलवेज एंड इफ देर इज अ डबल बॉन्ड और ट्रिपल बॉन्ड दे विल शो यू आई थिंक इट इज़ क्लियर अगर कंपाउंड में बॉन्ड नहीं शो किया जैसे ये कंपाउंड में कहीं भी बॉन्ड नहीं दिखाई दे रहा है मतलब सारा कार्बन का मिडिल में सिंगल बॉन्ड है इसलिए शो नहीं किया है बाई डिफॉल्ट Whenever there will be a double bond or triple bond, they will specify in the question. मतलब double bond और triple bond होने इस क्वेश्चन में तुमको double bond लिखा रहेगा triple bond लिखा रहेगा लेकिन जब भी भी कहीं भी bond नहीं है that means वो single bond है तो अभी ये two number carbon और three number carbon के बीच में कोई bond नहीं दिख रहा है that means there is a single bond. Then you write carbon number थ्री Carbon number थ्री का बाद में देखो double bond है you write double bond. Then there is carbon number फोर अभी तुम लोग हाइड्रोजन को लिखो कैसे कार्बन नंबर वन में कितना हाइड्रोजन है दो हाइड्रोजन है सो यू राइट लाइक दिस कार्बन नंबर वन हैज टू हाइड्रोजन नाउ कार्बन नंबर टू कार्बन नंबर टू में क्या है यू सी इन कार्बन नंबर टू देर इज नो हाइड्रोजन व्हाट इज देयर व्हाट इज देयर इन कार्बन नंबर टू देर इज नो हाइड्रोजन वट इज रिटर्न इन ब्रैकेट सी एच थ्री इज रिटर्न दैट मीन्स कार्बन नंबर टू के साथ में वट इज अटैच्ड सी एच थ्री ग्रुप इज अटैच राइट सो विथ कार्बन नंबर टू आई दर एब ऑल्सो यू कैन राइट यू कैन राइट Above also, like this also you can write, okay? I'm writing here, okay? You can write above also. So with carbon number two, what is there? CH three is there, right? Now what? Is, this is carbon number three. So with carbon number three, what is present? One hydrogen is present. So with carbon number three, above also you can do. ओके एबोर्व और बिलो इट इज़ योर चॉइस टोटली योर चॉइस ओके सो कार्बन नंबर थ्री व्हाट इज प्रेजेंट वन हाइड्रोजन सो विथ कार्बन नंबर थ्री यू पुट वन हाइड्रोजन नाउ यू सी विथ कार्बन नंबर टू व्हाट इज प्रेजेंट टू सी एच टू हाइड्रोजन आर प्रेजेंट सो विथ कार्बन नंबर फोर यू पुट टू हाइड्रोजन सी दिस इज ऑल्सो योर चॉइस यू कैन पुट हाइड्रोजन अप एंड डाउन ऑल्सो यू कैन पुट दिस साइड ऑल्सो ओके इट इज़ योर चॉइस सो लाइक वाइज यू विल हैव टू ड्रॉ द स्ट्रक्चर ऑफ एनी कंपाउंड okay this is the first and foremost rule you have to give the numbering first then you will see how many hydrogens are there you will put some uh, other groups are there apart from hydrogen like in carbon number 2 there was no hydrogen there was ch3 so with carbon number 2 what we will connect we will connect ch3 we will not put ch3 in the chain like this because this ch3 bracket mein likhne ka matlab ye hai ki ye carbon number 2 ke sath hai राइट right? और कार्बन नंबर टू के साथ जो है उसको आइधर ऊपर लिखना पड़ेगा या तो नीचे लाइन बॉन्ड करके लिखना पड़ेगा ठीक है तो ये सब छोटे छोटे पॉइंट्स हैं जो तुम लोग मिस्टेक कर रहे हो इसको यू हैव टू करेक्ट इट ओके देन 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 आई एम टेलिंग यू वन मोर थिंग दैट सच सच ग्रुप्स लाइक आई हैव सीन दैट दिस सी ओ ग्रुप ओके और सी एच ओ ग्रुप वेन एवर दीज टाइप्स ऑफ ग्रुप्स आर देयर सपोज वन कंपाउंड वॉज देयर लाइक सी एच थ्री सी एच टू सी ओ सी एच थ्री से दिस कंपाउंड इज गिवेन सो स्टूडेंट्स वॉट दे आर डूइंग आई हैव सीन दैट हाउ टू राइट द फॉर्मूला वॉट दे आर डूइंग दे आर राइटिंग लाइक दिस सी एच थ्री सी एच टू सी ओ सी एच थ्री Okay, now I am asking you. So the valency of this carbon, you check, it is completed. One, two, three, four bonds. This carbon, one, two, three, four bonds. Okay, this carbon, you check, what is the valency? One and two. Kya carbon ka valency two hai? Nahi. You will say carbon ka valency is to four, right? So carbon ka around me to four bonds hona chahiye tha. But when you write the CO like this. so there will be two bonds around the carbon so valency is not fulfilled that means your structure is wrong always i am telling you that when you write your structure you just check that each and every carbon is containing four bonds or not okay if not your structure is wrong so whenever such type of groups will be there in your compound co it is never present in the chain 
CO is never present in the chain. Either it is above or you have to put it below the chain. So I'll show you how. So this compound, first you will number it 1, 2, 3 and 4. Okay. So you will write like this C1, carbon number 1, then carbon number 2, 3, 4. Now with carbon number 1, how many hydrogens are there? 3 hydrogens. You put it with carbon number 2, 2 hydrogens are there. You put it with carbon number two, uh, 3, only oxygen is there, right? CO is there. So you will put like this oxygen. Always whenever you write a oxygen, you will put a double bond before the oxygen because oxygen has a valency of 2. Slowly and gradually you will learn how to write these all these, right? But as far as, as, as of now, I can just tell you to write C double bond O always. This is a group. This CO is a group known as the ketone group. Always there is a C double bond O. There is never a C single bond O because the carbon oxygen valency is 2. Then in carbon number 4, how many hydrogens are there? You write down 3 hydrogens are there. Like this you will write. Now you check the valency of each carbon. It will be filled. Like 1, you see 1, 2, 3, 4. Complete 1, 2, 3, 4. Complete 1, 2, 3, 4. Complete, right? 1, 2, 3, 4. Each and every carbon has 4 at, uh, bonds around it. So this structure is correct. So I hope you are getting what I am telling to, I am implying, okay, what I am trying to say. Now these were the small, small things that you were doing mistakes. So I thought that I would point out. So th these two is done. Now this compound, many of you are making the mistake. Okay, so this compound, so how to write the condensed formula and the bond line formula. So first of all, your work will be, I already told you that don't write, try to write the bond line formula from the condensed formula. Always write the bond line formula from the structural formula. It will be easy. It never you will do a mistake. Okay. So this compound is given. Okay. Now you see, you write this compound in the structural way first. Okay. So for that, you have to mark the carbons first. First, you have to mark the chain. Okay. So how you will mark? So this is already I have marked. You just see carbon number one. I have marked carbon number two. Carbon number 3, carbon number 4, carbon number 5. You can see I have not marked this carbon as 4. Why? Because this is a, this is not in the chain. Already I have said you it is present in bracket. So it is present with this third number carbon. Ye jo group hai, jo bracket mein hai, isko maine 4 mark kiyo nahi kiya. Kyunki ye jo uh, group hai, wo chain mein present nahi hai. वो ये थर्ड नंबर कार्बन के साथ में ही अटैच्ड है ओके तो जब हम लोग फॉर्म स्ट्रक्चर लिखेंगे तब ये CH3 ग्रुप को हम लोग आइदर ऊपर लिखेंगे कार्बन नंबर 3 का साथ आइदर नीचे लिखेंगे ठीक है एंड देन दिस इज व्हाई और ये देखो फोर नंबर साथ के साथ में दिस CH3 इज कनेक्टेड तो इसको भी हम लोग मार्क नहीं करना मार्क सिर्फ चेन को करना है ओनली द कार्बन चेन चेन यू अंडरस्टैंड आई थिंक चेन मींस ईच एंड एवरी कार्बन इज कनेक्टेड टू वन अनदर ओके देयर इज नो ब्रेकेज इन बिटवीन इट इज अ कंटिन्यू कंटिन्यूइटी सो नाउ वंस यू हैव मार्क्ड यू राइट द स्ट्रक्चरल फार्मूला हाउ टू राइट सो यू विल राइट ओएच सीएच2 नो नीड टू राइट दिस हाइड्रोजन सेपरेटली ओके सीएच2 सीएच नाउ दिस सीएच3 यू नो सो दिस इज नाउ वन दिस इज टू दिस इज थ्री so this CH3, how you will write? No, you will not write like this. You will not write like this. This is wrong. How do you write? With three number car carbon, you will write below like this CH3. Then there is the four number carbon. With four number carbon, again one CH3 group is present. Okay, and then there is the five number carbon. Okay, like this you will write. Then you will write the bond line formula. Now how you will write? This is OH. Okay. In bond line formula, uh, students have doubt, right? So this is the OH. Already I have said you that in bond line formula, you will not show the carbon. You will not show the hydrogen. But any other groups apart from carbon and hydrogen, you have to show. 
Now with OH, what is connected? The carbon number one is connected. Yes, yes or no? Ye carbon number one ke saath mein OH is directly connected, right? So OH ke saath mein carbon number one ko ek line bana ke connect karo. Mane bond bana ke connect karo, right? So this is your, this bond. So this, this point is the carbon. So you mark it carbon number one. Then you are coming again. So this is this bond. Okay, this bond is this bond, right? So now come to carbon number two. So this will be carbon number two, obviously, this point. Again, from this carbon number two, this bond is this bond. Okay, then you are coming to carbon number three. So this is carbon number three. So I have marked here carbon number three. Now you see with carbon number three, what is present? CH3 group is present, right? Jo bhi carbon number three ke saath mein upar ya niche koi group hai. That means wo carbon number three ka partner hai, you can say. Substituent hai, okay? So carbon number three ke saath mein yahan pe ek CH3 group tha. Isi liye you have to give one line like this. This is the bond and this is the carbon here present, okay? And carbon, you know, since this is making one bond, so here will be three hydrogens automatic because carbon ka valency four hai. Agar ek bond carbon make bana raha hai yahan pe, to three hydrogen hoga. So you have need not show this CH3 by writing. Automatic, it is understood that it is CH3 only, right? Now you come to this bond. So this is this bond, okay? So this is carbon number four. So this is carbon number four. Now with carbon number 4, again one CH3 group is present. So either you do yahan pe likho, either niche likho, kahi bhi likho, no problem. Right? So here I have written. Now, now carbon number 4 done. After number carbon number 4, what is present? Carbon number 5 is present. Now carbon number 5 you keep like this. So carbon number 5 is what? CH3. So if So this point is CH3. Okay. So I hope so, so like this in this way you have to go one by one if you try that you you can do everything in one class it is not possible you have to practice again and again see in this video I am limited in class if it would this COVID-19 situation would not have occurred in class I would have each student every student could get it but now I am also bound okay in video only I can explain you so you try to see the video again and again you try to get it okay and then if you cannot do then also then you can ask me personally okay so this is the thing how you have to write the bond line formula so one by one first of all you will give the numbering of the carbons okay numbering say 50% uh, work ho jayega iske baad mein tum dekhoge ki kaun sa uh, carbon chain mein hai kaun sa carbon chain mein nahi hai ठीक है जिस जो चेन में नहीं है उसको ब्रांच में लिखना पड़ेगा आइदर ऊपर लिखना पड़ेगा आइदर नीचे लिखना पड़ेगा उसको चेन में नहीं लिखना पड़ेगा ठीक है इसके बाद में यू विल सी दैट फंक्शनल ग्रुप्स जो भी ऐसा ग्रुप्स है ठीक है उसको तुम लोग को मेंशन करना पड़ेगा बॉन्ड लाइन फॉर्मूला में ओके एंड दिस इज द कंडेंस फार्मूला सो कंडेंस फार्मूला आल्सो आई वुड लाइक टू टेल हाउ टू राइट द कंडेंस फार्मूला यू सी इन दिस ओएच इज देयर यू विल राइट यू कैन सी दैट uh, together, एक साथ ही CH2, CH2 दो बार repeat हो रहा है, ठीक है? तो condensed formula मैंने क्या बोला? जितना हो सके, इतना shortcut में लिखो। That is only condensed formula. Shortcut is condensed formula, okay? So CH2 instead of writing two times, can we not write one time? Yes. So what we have done? We have written CH2 once. We have given a bracket. We have written two outside. That means what? CH2 दो बार है। ये automatic क्या समझा रहा है? CH2 दो बार है। अभी CH2 तो हो गया CH2 के बाद में क्या है CH है तो CH लिखो ठीक है CH के साथ में क्या है CH3 है तो लिखो वैसे ही लिखो अभी ये CH ठीक है four number इसको भी लिखना पड़ेगा अभी देखो four number CH के साथ में ये CH3 भी attached है ये CH3 भी attached है instead of writing two times can we not write CH3 whole two with this CH right here I have written so that means what with this CH it is automatic explaining that with this CH group two CH3 groups are linked right yes CH ke saath mein do CH3 groups linked hai is tarah se to ye automatic explain karega chik hai to as much as possible shortcut you have to write in case of condensed formula okay now one student was asking me that why means this is also CH and this is also CH you are telling if same groups are there we can write double 
right we can write like this ch2 and this is also ch3 this is ch3 this is ch3 so we can write ch3 whole 3 why not like this okay why separately like this see the uh, ob obvious answer is that ये सी एच के साथ में एक ही सी एच थ्री कनेक्टेड है ये सी एच के साथ में दो सी एच थ्री कनेक्टेड है अगर तुम लोग ऐसा लिखोगे तो एग्जामिनर को कैसे पता चलेगा कि ये सी एच के साथ में कितना सी एच थ्री है और दूसरा वाला सी एच के साथ में कितना सी एच थ्री कनेक्टेड है है ना दैट्स वाई ये सब चीज़ में तुम लोग इतना भी शॉर्टकट मत मारो कि एग्जामिनर को वो भाग जाए मतलब उसको कुछ समझ में नहीं है इतना भी शॉर्टकट नहीं मारना ठीक है शॉर्टकट वहाँ यूज़ करना है वेयर देर इज़ अ रूम स्पेस ओके लाइक यहाँ पे यहाँ पे सी एस टू दो बार ऑटोमेटिक यू कैन राइट टू टाइम्स ओके दैट देयर यू विल अप्लाई योर कॉमन सेंस अ लिटिल बिट ओके सो दिस इज नॉट फिजिक्स दिस इज नॉट रॉकेट साइंस दैट इट इज सो टफ ओके फिजिक्स ऑल्सो नॉट टफ इज नॉट सो टफ इफ यू स्टडी एवरीथिंग इज ईजी बिकॉज यू आर न्यू टू ऑल दिस नो दैट्स वाई यू आर फाइंडिंग प्रॉब्लम्स Now here you see these these compound also many many of the students have made a mistake. So this also I would like to explain you. So how to write again? I have given the marking first. So this is carbon one, carbon two, carbon three, carbon four, carbon five. Okay. So here also you can see the bracketed ones. I have not given any number because they are either above the plane or below. They are not in the chain. Okay. They are they are either above the chain or below the chain. They are not present in the chain. Okay. How do we write the condensed formula? First, you have to write the structural formula. So you write the structural formula. So how you will write NH two, CH two, CH. Now this CH three is present with this CH. So you will write below like this CH three. Then there is CH. Then there is OH. With this CH, one OH is present, right? Bracket में है ना? Three number के साथ में bracket में है ना? तो ये OH CH के साथ में. ये CH three, ये CH के साथ में connected है, okay? Then there is C. Then there is CH three, CH three, CH three, right? Like this. So this is the structural formula. Now you can easily write your uh, bond line formula. How? So you write NH two first. NH two, so you will show because it is the functional group. Okay. Then you will write carbon number one. So this is your carbon number one. This is this bond. This bond. Okay. Now this bond is this one. So this is carbon number two. So this is carbon number two. With carbon number two, you can see what is there. One line I have given. That means this CH three is there. जहाँ भी line है, that is CH three groups, right? So this is this CH three. Now this this bond again, you come this one, right? This is carbon number three. So this is carbon number three. With carbon number three, you see in the structural formula what is present? OH is present. So with carbon number three, what I have given? OH I have given. This bond, right? This is carbon number four. This is carbon number four. With carbon number four, how many CH three groups are there? One, two, three. Right. So it is so 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 simple, right? So once you practice, everything becomes very simple. Now this is the condensed formula. I hope it is clear how the condensed formula is written. यहाँ पे shortcut मारने के लिए कुछ भी नहीं था. खाली यहाँ पे shortcut मार दिया. C लिख के CH three तीन बार था. और तीनों सी एच थ्री इसी कार्बन के साथ में कनेक्टेड है नो प्रॉब्लम सो इसी कार्बन के साथ में लिख के सी एच थ्री होल थ्री लिख दिया ठीक है ना दिस कंपाउंड आल्सो लास्ट कंपाउंड आई वांट टू शो यू दिस आल्सो मेनी स्टूडेंट हैव अ डाउट ओके हाउ टू राइट दी बॉन्ड लाइन फॉर्मूला ओके सो फर्स्ट राइट दिस स्ट्रक्चरल फॉर्मूला सो मार्किंग आई है Five, six, seven. Again, the bracket ones I have not given because they are either present above or below the chain. So B R C H two number one, C H two number two. Then there is C O. Remember, I have already told you. You will write C O like this, right? Here you will write the oxygen. Then there is C H. Now with C H, this four number C H. What is present? This C H three. So you will write like this CH three above also you can write your wish. Then again five number CH two, six number CH two, seven number CH three. Right now you write the bond line formula. So this is Br. Then this bond comes one number carbon bond one number carbon. Okay, this carbon point. This bond is this one two number carbon. This is two number carbon. This is the bond this one. 
okay then comes the three number carbon this is the three number carbon then comes the double bond o this is the double bond o with the three number carbon many students what they have done they have written like this co this is wrong this is wrong this co this carbon of this co is in the chain remember okay this co carbon is in the chain it is not like this this, this is wrong okay some of the students have done who, who have done not this mistake they will automatically realize okay so others no need to panic so this is carbon number three this is carbon number four so this is this bond this one again comes carbon number four with carbon number four again you can see one ch3 group so i have given one line here then this bond again carbon number five is this one so this is carbon number five then again this bond bond carbon number six this is carbon number six again this bond this one this is last one carbon number seven so this is carbon number seven this is the ch3 group okay so in such a way you will have to make the bond line formula you will have to make the condensed formula you have to practice as many questions as you can i'll give you the questions okay first though whatever i have explained you just now you try to do whatever mistakes you have done you try to rectify them again you ask me you clear it once only okay because these are the basics if you are not clear how to write the structure you cannot name the structure because in further classes you will have more doubts because we are going to learn the naming naming is more dangerous okay so here once you know how don't know how to write the structure you cannot name also because structure hi wrong hoga to name to wrong hoga hi hoga hai na isliye students jo bhi abhi doubts maine clear kiya isko jao jiska bhi doubts tha koi baat nahi pehla baar hai doubts ho gayi जिसका डाउट्स नहीं है मतलब उन लोग किया भी नहीं जिसका डाउट्स निकला है मतलब दे हैव एटलीस्ट ट्राइड ओके सो आई एम वेरी इम्प्रेस दैट यू हैव ट्राइड ओके बट व्हाट यू डू यू जस्ट गो आफ्टर वॉच दिस वीडियो यू गो एंड यू जस्ट करेक्ट इट इफ यू कैन नॉट डू देन ऑल्सो यू जस्ट वॉच द वीडियो अगेन अगेन एंड अगेन यू वॉच देन ऑल्सो इफ यू कैन नॉट यू आस्क मी आई क्लियर इट अगेन ओके सो थैंक यू